Hello, this is Tori with Landio. We have a new 160-acre ranch in Wyoming bordering both state and BLM land. This is the parcel highlighted here in green. You can see that the entire north boundary borders this 640-acre section of BLM land, and then the entire east boundary borders this section of state land. And this state land right here has what is called the crust and draw flowing through it. And if we turn on the topographic map, you can see how that's labeled the crust and draw. And you can see it visually from the south satellite image as well. And then there's this seasonal water flow that runs through the property down here in the southwest quarter. You can see where that's evidence there. And then here's the crust and draw. You can see in this satellite image, there's some water collected there in like a pond. And you can see how that flows. The lush green area then is an indication that there's you know, water that flows through there. And then you have this road that runs through the southwest corner. If we take a look at the property on the Google Earth terrain view, you can see how that that is all consistent there. And we'll look at these actual mountain views from the property, which are really amazing. So there you have the dirt road running through the southwest corner of the property. Here's that seasonal water flow. And then here you have the crest and draw. If we go back to the topographic map, you can see that there's a, a slope from the north to the south. So you have a high elevation point here. This is roughly 6,750 feet right here. And then that slopes down here to about a little below 6,700 feet. So this high point is going to give you some really amazing views. This is the dirt road that leads to the property. There you can see our photographer's truck right there. You have amazing views from the property in all directions. These photos were taken in the last couple weeks, so this is what the vegetation looks like in the fall and winter, but then in the spring and summer it's bright, vibrant, and green. The property is located just west of Rollins and just north of Interstate 80. So Rollins has a population around 10,000. You can find pretty much anything you need in Rollins. There's a Walmart Supercenter. There's medical care at a hospital. There's there's restaurants, building supplies, tractor supplies, feed store, restaurants, and professional services. Then you have the city of Casper up here to the northeast. That has a population around 60,000. Then Laramie over to the east, population over 30,000. And then further to the east, you have Cheyenne, Wyoming, which is the largest city in Wyoming with a little under 100,000 people. And you're surrounded by amazing hunting, fishing, water sports, and outdoor recreational activities. You have the Seminole Reservoir and State Park, the Miracle Mile, you have the Alcova Reservoir, the Pathfinder Reservoir, North Platte River, you have the Ferris Mountains, and the Medicine Bow National Forest. In addition to bordering 640 acres of BLM land to the north and 640 acres of state land to the east, the property is surrounded by public land. Collectively, there's over a million acres of public land surrounding the property in all directions. This area is rich in native wildlife. There are fresh wildlife tracks and droppings on the property. Carbon County, where the property is located, is considered to be the pronghorn capital of the United States. States. There's also lots of wild horses in the area, very popular for sage grouse. And then here's more evidence of wildlife on the property. This property is only eight miles from Interstate 80, and we've got the path to the property mapped out here. And this path is also available on the interactive map. So if you go over here to the legend, and then you click the primary road layer, what that'll do is that will turn on the path to the property. When you're on Interstate 80, whether you're coming from the east or the west, you're going to take exit 196. Then you're going to head north, and then turn immediately east onto BLM road number 3203. And that is going to turn around here. And that's going to take you north. And then you're going to be heading towards this water treatment plant right here. And this road's going to go around the water treatment plant back through here. And then you're going to come down south into the property. We have some photos of that mapped out. This is exit 196. You can see where you turn there on 196. Now you're heading towards the water treatment plant. Here we are heading towards the water treatment plant. And then this is the road that goes around the water treatment plant. Then you head through this unlocked gate, and then here we are on the dirt road, which runs through the southwest corner of the property. These are some aerial photos. You can see there is the road right there. Here are the Ferris Mountains to the northeast. This is a path of the seasonal water flow on the property. You can see how dense this vegetation is. So in the spring and summer, this is going to be lush and green. Some evidence of frozen water on the property. Here's a survey marker on the property. You have these expansive big sky views in all directions. Here you can see some of the gentle slope. There are electric electricity lines and poles about a mile and a half west of the property if that's something that you're interested in. Most of the people out here will use solar and wind and other types of off-grid technologies. And you have amazing mountain views from the property. This is the Wyoming Game and Fish Department website and they have these hunting maps available. So the property is located in area 61 for antelope hunting, area 118 for elk hunting, area 98 for deer, area 11 for mountain lion. It's just to the west of area 17 where you'll find bighorn sheep.
sheep. And this also is where you'll find the Ferris Mountains. And you're in area 11 for pheasant hunting, area 1 for sage grouse, and in area 5 for wild turkey. From the property, you're only about 40 minutes to Rollins. Again, Rollins has a population around 10,000. There's the Walmart Supercenter in Rollins. There's the Memorial Hospital of Carbon County. This is Main Street in Rollins. You're about two and a half hours to the Seminole Reservoir in the Seminole State Park, which is an incredibly beautiful area. There you have the Seminole Dam. Then you're about two hours to the Alcova Reservoir, which is popular for fishing, boating, and camping. About two and a half hours to the Pathfinder Reservoir. And all of these reservoirs are publicly accessible. And these reservoirs are created from the North Platte River. So this is the Miracle Mile along the North Platte River. It's a world famous fishing destination. It's known for trophy rainbow trout. This is Fremont Canyon along the North Platte River. Here we have people fishing in Fremont Canyon. And you're about two and a half hours to Casper again. Casper has a population around 60,000. Just a little over two hours from Laramie, Wyoming, which has a population around 31,000. About two hours and 44 minutes to the Medicine Bow National Forest, which is another incredibly beautiful area. And then about two hours and 48 minutes to Cheyenne, Wyoming. Again, Cheyenne is the largest city in Wyoming, population around 100,000. Then going down into Colorado, you're about two hours and 49 minutes to Fort Collins, which has a population of around 150,000. Then you're about four hours to Denver, Colorado. Denver and the metropolitan area have a population well over a million. We have this 160-acre ranch in Wyoming bordering both state and BLM land priced at just $300 an acre, so that's only $48,000 for this 160-acre parcel. All the property details are listed here on our website, including the distances to the nearby points of interest and additional information about those locations. Here we have the GPS coordinates, over 150 images, and this interactive map. Our properties in Wyoming have been selling very fast. If you go up here to our properties tab and then you click on Wyoming, you can see that this is the only property that we have available. All of our other Wyoming properties have sold. Sometimes they'll sell in a day or two. This list right here includes 20 properties that we've sold in Wyoming, with this property being the only one available right now. So if this property fits what you're looking for, we highly recommend that you go to our website and click on this Buy Now button. What that'll do is add a deposit of $499 to your cart. Then click Checkout. Once you click Checkout, this window will appear where you can enter in all your information, then continue through the checkout process. Once the checkout process has been completed, we'll receive an instant notification that your $499 deposit has been made. We'll then take the property off the market, send you over a simple one-page purchase agreement, and arrange for the balance of payment. Once you place the deposit, this Buy Now button changes to Out of Stock. So there's only one person that can place a deposit on this property. We only have one of these properties to sell. That $499 deposit is credited towards your purchase, and then we cover all of the closing costs. We make the whole process super simple. There's no other costs involved, and we can complete the sale in as little as a day. If you have any questions, our phone number is on top of every page of our website. That number is 713-597-7670. That number also receives text messages. We also have this live chat feature here on our website where you can communicate with us in real time. We try to be available as often as possible. If we're not available for whatever reason, please send us a message and we'll respond to you at our next availability. We also have this contact form here on our website where you can send us a message or you can email us directly. Our email address is hello at landio.com. And as always, we really appreciate you taking the time to watch our videos and share our properties with all your family, friends, and colleagues. May God continue to bless you and your family.